All right, we are now transmitting live on Justin.tv. Hi, everyone. I'm Rick Zanotti. Uh, I am joined today by Terrence Wing and our special guest, Shamir Ayapan from Adobe. Um, we will do a formal introduction later, but we are now in the pre show show. Um, let me switch show. over. If anybody wants to go, if you guys want to go to justin.tv slash relate corp, you will be able to see um, the video of the um, of the show. Let me uh, just switch screens. Everything's looking good. Shamir, you look good. Thank you. <laughs> uh, you know what? If you want to lower your screen a little bit, bring yourself down a bit, you'll probably be good. You're a little, no, a little the other way, other way. The other down. There you go, right there. Uh, that's good. Now we got Better? you good. Yeah, you know, you have really good color on you too. The lighting's oh. good, and um, your mouth is actually moving with. That's pretty. You know, you were complaining about low bandwidth. It looks good. Yeah, since I'm st taking this from home, I am still concerned, considering that my wife is on a call on the other room. Oh, she is. <laughs> so yeah, so I have no idea. What is she Let's doing? See how Why it goes. is she talking so late at night? Right. <laughs> Yeah, we won't I think she's talking to people anymore. out there on the West Coast itself. So, okay, and that's our three-way shot. Um, I'm just gonna tweak this one a little bit. Let me tweak this one a bit. So, Shamir, I don't think you and I have ever uh, met before. No, we've not been. Um, and yeah, I've never spoken to you either or interacted now. Yeah, so it's, I'm glad to, uh, you know, to finally get the chance to. Rick's told me a lot about you. Hey, great. Yes. All, all uh, good. Good to meet you here. <laughs> so um, uh, what do you do, Terence? Um, I, you know I, mean? I do a blended learning design. Okay. With, a, with a, an acute focus on uh, business skills and leadership development. Okay. Okay. So um, you're more an instructional designer, or do you even, you know, author the content and things like that? All the above. Uh, Everything. Instructional designer, author the content, um, uh, graphic design, you know, videographer. Oh, okay. He dances. I dance. <laughs> <laughs> I do. That's actually that's more and more the case now in the U.S., right? Um, you hardly find people who are specialized in, you know, just instructional design and don't do any content development or do just content development and don't do any ID or graphic design. So yeah. people seem to wear multiple hats. They do. A lot more. Mm -hmm. It's called the economy. Yeah. <laughs> Well, you know, it's called the tools are getting easier to work with as well. So it's just uh, it's easier to to do all those things. That's probably true. That's true. Now, Shamir, I don't know if you're watching Justin TV, um, but if you if you're if you are watching it, then there's a chat window which I monitor uh, throughout the entire program, and if anybody any of our live audience has questions um if you see it you could definitely answer it uh but we find that most of the guests you know get a little distracted by it so i'll be monitoring it and if there is a question i'll uh, be sure to uh, to communicate that to you during the show sure do that um not uh, i mean i've not turned on justin.tv mainly because I'm not sure how it would affect my bandwidth because as i said i'm on a dsl line and i'm not sure <laughs> I think you'll okay. be I think you'll be happen. fine because that's coming down and your bandwidth going up is is not going to change. Okay. Uh, I can you try, know what? try it. Try it now but before either we start. It's, um, you know I mean I would prefer <clears throat> it if Terence can monitor it and you know I mean shoot me any questions that come up over there so We just I want you ask. to see our real cute faces while we're online. That's <laughs> <laughs> I'll do that. No, I mean I'll definitely go online and check just Dot yes, one sec. Sure. Uh, Shamir, can I get a little uh, talk from you? I want to make sure your levels are good. Sure, can you hear me well now? Yes. Okay. Okay. Just going to up you a little bit. Terrence, can I get some words out of you? 
words of wisdom or just any words in particular? No, that's good. All that comes out of you is wisdom. Uh, thank you. We got uh, Lily and Jeff are in the uh, in the chat room now too. Hello, Lily and Jeff. How are you? Jeff is uh, in Australia in Melbourne, and Lily is in well, you know, you know, Leva. She's in Belgium. Hi. And Shamir is in India. So we've got Skype doing a double time duty right now, working all across the world. Great. Amazing. It's actually really amazing. If you think about the technology today, it's it's just great. That's true. It's uh, pretty late in Melbourne, right? For someone to be there. Uh, he's probably up pretty late, too. Uh, there are different time zones from you, right? A couple of hours Yeah, different? or he's probably up early because I think it's probably closer to like 4.30 or 5 in the morning over there. Oh, is it really? It. I mean, I think it's like four and a half hours ahead of oh, it's where still, I am. it's still quite a bit of difference. <clears throat> yeah, so it's like four o'clock in the morning, I'm guessing. Jeff, you are an early riser. We're going to have to send you a consolation prize for waking up so early. And he's, he's doing it every week, too. I, I, wow. I feel we should feel honored. And uh, he'll actually be coming to uh, Learning Solutions, and I'm, I'm not sure if the Adobe Learning Summit, but he'll be, um, he'll be out there in Orlando this March. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I wish I could okay, say so I was going too. Well, we don't know yet, right? No, we don't know yet. We'll put a little pressure I can on. Uh, see the feed on justin.tv so you can hey, Terrence, now i can oh, you see your see face it. and i can yes. we're all, we're all waving. <laughs> you know so assign a face to the name now there is sometimes there's a well there, there's always a slight delay but the delay can sometimes get greater depending on your bandwidth um at least that's what we're finding and uh, I've seen it uh, as high as about 10 to 12 seconds of a delay. So, you know, just keep that in mind. If you're if you are watching yourself and you don't see yourself doing something that you are doing, it, it might be a while before you actually it catches up to you. OK. Yeah, I'm not going to keep watching this because I know that it's going to throw me off if I keep looking at this or looking at the chat. So that's fine. Well, what happens with people is they start looking at themselves and and all of a sudden they fall in love. It <laughs> <laughs> or they look at this and they fall in love with you, Rick. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Brains and beauty. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> and, and you are good looking. I, I'm sorry. If the, the brains just come naturally. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think we've got pretty good volume right now. Everything seems to be working. We have about oh, about six more minutes. You know, my yep. my PC is a little bit off. What time do you have, Terrence? I got we have uh, I've got nine fifty five. Okay, so I'm about three minutes late on this PC. Or, or yeah, I have nine fifty two. So let me change that. <clears throat> yeah, I'm really that. really interested in uh, in hearing the audio from from this this mic now because the reason why I went out to get it was because I was looking at uh, pretty much all of the uh, archives that we have on eLearn chat and I was finding that your mic was was incredible I mean your voice is incredible and the guest voice even sounds really good but for some reason the mic I was using my webcam mic, not my webcam mic but the, the mic I was using was just not, you know, picking up the uh, the sound I wanted it to. So okay. I went out and got this one. <clears throat> this sounds good. It it has more resonance to it. It's it's not. It's a little lower. Okay. Sounds there, good. I'm I'm sure there's more I can do with it, but I just plugged it all up uh, last night and haven't really played around with it much. So what kind of mixer did you get? I got a uh, a Steinberg uh, CI2. Okay. Yeah, it's it's one of those uh, USB um, uh, sounding uh, sound studios. Okay. So it's, I guess it's not really a mixer. Well, the it has it has multiple it channels, mixer. right? Uh, yeah, it just has two channels. It's it's um, 
I don't think they call it a mixer. They just call it the uh, the USB studio. It's, it's probably an interface. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it sounds good. Good. Does it have controls for... Um, the gain? Uh, well, it has gain, but does it have anything like equalization or... Uh, sometimes they have um, uh, other kind of filters. So you can change your EQ. They may have a compressor. Yeah, it, it does through the software, but I haven't figured out the software yet. I have to play around with it. Yeah, compressors are always good because they give you a little bit more of the... They cut a little bit of the highs out. They cut the lows out, and they make everything sound just a little bit fuller. Mm -hmm. I don't have a compressor on this thing. Um, I've got the uh, Mackie mixer, and... It has a lot of stuff, but it doesn't have compression, so it's okay. And I'm, the mic I'm using right now is—I don't know if you can see it here. This is the—it's uh, oh, a little far. There it goes. That's the um, Electro Voice. I'm, this is a different one. I don't think I—maybe I used it last week. This is the Electro Voice RE27, which is uh, a real good radio broadcasting mic, uh, mm -hmm. made famous in radio and broadcasting. The nice thing about it is you can have a lot of noise around you, and it's quiet. It doesn't pick most of it up. It tends to keep everything right around your mouth, and um, it, has a, it has a pretty good sound. You can get real close to it and sound almost like a radio DJ. Yeah. <laughs> if you're homeless, I'd say you sound like Ted Williams. Oh, he's great. I love that guy's <laughs> voice. <laughs> That's a great story. It, it really is. is. It really is. Guy, who needs, guy who gone needs, bad, and then he cleans himself up, and yeah. on, he's on the street, and somebody finds him. I know. It's amazing. But and he does who, have a nice who, voice. Who would ever thought that, you know, you? Well, why Why should we work hard to get what we want to? We should just become homeless. Um, <laughs> Being a little sarcastic. All right, we're getting ready to go live. Shamir, can I get uh, one more sound check out of you? Sure. Can you hear me right? Yep, you sound good. And Terrence, one last time? Testing one, two, three. Okay, I think we are good on audio. Uh, no one's clipping. We're all sounding fairly natural. <clears throat> Shamir, product manager for e-learning or for Adobe Captivate? For both. For both. And presenter now, so. Oh, oh you've acquired another one. Captivate presenter and email okay. suite, yes. Okay. I heard there's, um, is there a presenter beta right now or it's coming? I heard it's, that's the great There's line. no presenter beta currently. Not but currently. yes, that should be something soon, yes. Okay, great. All right, good. More responsibilities for you. <laughs> for, I'm, I'm sorry, I was doing something. Which products again, Shamir? Captivate, e-learning suite, and presenter. Okay, great. <clears throat> is uh, Connect part of the e-learning suite? Do no, Connect is no. not. No, but but presenter integrates with Connect, as do some of the other products. That's true. Presenter is very tightly integrated with Connect, and it's sold with Connect mm -hmm. most often. Okay, I think we are ready to go live. What I'm going to do now is you're going to see the screen go black for a moment. I'm okay. going to mute both your channels for just a moment. And we are going to go mute, and then we are going to start the introduction. So uh, we are now beginning the recording. You're listening to eLearn Chat, where talk is knowledge. Hello and welcome to eLearn Chat, our new podcast featuring prominent leaders, shakers and movers in the e-learning and training industry. Your co-hosts are Rick Zanotti and Terrence Wing. The show is sponsored by Relate Corporation. You can visit us at www.relate.com. And also by Liquid Learn. You can visit that at www.liquidlearn.com. And hello, everyone. I am Rick Zanotti, and this is our second episode of the year for eLearn Chat. Now, today we've got a special guest. We've got Shamir Ayapan from Adobe joining us. But before we get to Shamir, let me introduce you to our co-host, Terrence Wing. Hi, Terrence. How are you? 
Hi, Rick. Hi, Shamir. Hope everybody's doing well out there. It's uh, good to see you. This is our, our what, our second show of the, the new year.